What you see there, I checked online and found a, a site and uh, to do locally with the pond and stream here. That culvert goes under the canal to the other side and I believe they're using it to go through and over to the other side to get sprigs of wood and whatever. And as always, the dam, there's some openings around it. They've been up and around it. I found a few wet spots and a track right there up the bank. They ventured no further than that. Perhaps I've scared them off somewhat. In the summertime when the stream dries out, I am going to venture and try to go through that. It'll be like a tunnel, only it'll be drier then. And so that, that might be a future adventure to look forward to for me. I don't know about you. As far as I can tell, that tree right there, I believe that's where the stream comes out under this here canal. I believe this is the area where the uh, chute was that I spotted them eating and enjoying meals before Christmas. It's my theory, I think I've previously mentioned it, that they seed the stream with uh, sprigs and logs to come out and chew on. They have the, uh, an amazing ability that lets them chew and eat while underwater. And they can be out under the ice surface for up to 11 or 12 minutes that I know of for sure. But uh, I believe that there, there may be some sort of shelter or indeed one of them or some have a lodge right in there. Uh, the ice does not look safe around this area, so I haven't ventured out on the stream. We're on the other side of the stream now, and this is the tree that I was looking at. And I don't think there's a way down into the thicket here, so we're going to have to find a way around and backtrack. I've been down there once before and didn't see sign of anything. But that uh, stream has to come out in or around this spot down in here. My theory has proven right. They can go through that opening. I'm on the other side of the stream now. And there's one moving up towards me to go back over. Oh, he's, he's over in here. I think he's spotted me. He's being very cautious. He's carrying a small log. I think it's one of the bigger beavers. Or at least an adult. Sorry, I'm hand-holding. So I'm going to crouch down. see him there and he's gonna and he's taking that log he's going under the ice and this is the other side the culvert you can see he's under the ice there now traveling back over to the other side so I I finally figured out where they've gone to and where they go to and from Taking something back the other way now. Stopping for a bite. Noisy eater. So I 
think the next few times I come down here, I'm just as apt to come over to this point. He heard me break some twigs over here, so he's back chewing on his food. It is one of the big ones, so I don't know whether it could be Big Mama or Big Daddy.